Hello! <laughs> happy hump day! No, happy Wednesday, aka hump day. How's it going, everyone? Welcome, welcome. You ready for some more Kirby? Kirby? Ugh, oh, I'm tired today. Uh, I plugged in my new Xbox. It's working. Uh, that's cool. Nice. Uh, besides that, yeah, it was a quiet day here in the Floridas. In the Floridians. We survived another day in Florida. <laughs> um, yeah. Oh, you know what? So, well, so the next game is Star Fox. I don't think Star Fox is going to be a very long game. Not sure about, uh, uh, there is no game wrong dimension. I don't think Wolfenstein 3D is a very long game. So we could be through this set of games uh, really, really quickly. You slept 13 hours? I would have loved to have slept 13 hours, Iowa. I did not, though. I slept probably like five. Maybe five and a half. Uh, I'll say six. <laughs> Um, so what I was thinking was we should start the boat. <laughs> let's do, let's do more voting again for the next series of games. Yeah, I figured let's start it because I'm worried that we don't have Dragon Warrior 2 that lasts 30 streams in order to finish the vote. So I'm worried that we don't have enough time to finish the vote because the games are so short. So we have Kirby and the Amazing Something. Amazing Mirror. And then Kirby and the Something Something. I got to bring up my spreadsheet. The logos on these things are not very good. Kirby Squeak Squad. And then return to Dreamland. And so I didn't realize he left Dreamland, but apparently, yeah, there's a lot of games in between with no Dreamland. So he returns to Dreamland. Uh, we have uh, the new wheel with Ape Escape and uh, the wild something. <laughs> wild! I don't remember what it is. The something wilds. Anyway. The wild. So we're going to be voting for these four things right here. What'd you say, Neil? The Wild Boys. The Wild Boys? It's not Wild Boys. Wild Boys. It's not that. The arrow was directly on Eco. Oh, it was. <laughs> I guess. So we are going to be voting. Voting. Four this is vote 14, believe it or not. I can't. We're going to read reporting scores. And the first one. And so we're going to be voting in the, in the interface, just like we always do. Uh, la, 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 la. Let me pull up the... Oh, thank you, Flaming Baguette. Yes, we got, we got our... Our hair's cut. I got my beard trimmed. He was like, I love your beard, and it's shorter. And I say, thank you, sweetie. Yeah, I thought you turned out cute. <laughs> hey, Scorpio. Congrats on winning the fry. All right, so the first one is Elite Beat Agents. Versus Phoenix, right? Oh, I think it's Justice for All. Yeah. We're just going to put PW Ace Ernie Justice. Oh man, we're not doing that. PWAA Justice for All. Here, uh, see, I don't like that.
Sorry. Okay, here we go. Vote. Vote. There's the matchup. That's true. Right off the bat, two Nintendo DS games. How wild. Um, I did order, uh, there's like Apollo Justice, a trilogy coming out on Switch. I ordered that. And, um, apparently they are DS games that were only available on the DS store, the 3DS store. And so they're gone because the store shut down. So I went ahead and bought those so that when we eventually get to those games, we have them. Oh, you know what? I'm not even looking at the vote. Hey, Satorni! I knew that would win. Why did you know that was going to win? Because of the people that come here and how <laughs> they reacted to the game. Objection! Before. What's funny, I've I've played that one Ace Attorney game, and I haven't played... This is the second one. It hasn't been winning the vote. So, all right, the score has been submitted. All right, the next one we are doing is... Hey, Matthew J. New poll. It's Wonder Boy. Wonder Boy. And Might and Magic. And your mom. And your mom. There you go. It's an excuse to buy a Sega Master System. <laughs> it's a system we don't have. You like a Sega Master System? We do not have a Sega Master System. I know that we don't. I said we like one. Well, I'll wait till we get a, a candidate. I wasn't expecting an answer. You weren't expecting just, what? It, I wasn't really expecting an answer. I was just uh, talking a little weird. Oh. <laughs> oh, is there a Master System attachment for the Genesis? What? Yeah, Sega did that a lot. Like, attach this thing to this thing and make it... Attach this, this CD to the Sega. Attach, uh, what was it? Knuckles to this game. All right, here's the next one. Cotton. Fantastic Night Dreams. Versus Epic Mickey. New, a new one on there. Oh, boys and girls. Hello, boys and girls. I'm Mickey Mouse. <laughs> Your Mickey Mouse is terrible. <laughs> I wasn't super trying, uh, to be honest. Um, you know, I think it's weird when you can pull up more items in a grocery store search by typing mayo than by fully typing mayonnaise. <laughs> A lot of people have abbreviated it, I guess. The weirdest abbreviation I ever saw for that product is uh, Wendy's, and it would say Mayon. <laughs> uh -oh. oh, someone broke the tie. Oh, and that's tied again. Oh! Oh, <laughs> that was close. That was close. Close, but no cigar. Yeah. All right. We're going to do one more. We're going to try it because I'm worried. Actually, we're going to do two more. We're going to do five per segment because, again, I'm worried about these uh, finishing before. So, And these don't take too long. 
Echo the Dolphin versus Solomon S O L O M O N's key. They call him Echo. Echo. What? How does that go? Flipper, 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 king of the ocean? King of the sea? King of maybe? the sea? I don't remember. They call him Echo. That, that Echo. show was before my time. Yeah, it was for me too. We're old, but we're not that old. We're not, we're I not mean, flipper old. I remember seeing it, right? But like it yeah, wasn't. It was uh, like in black and white. No, we're, it was in color. Was it in color? <laughs> I was going to say, we're color kids, baby. Well, I mean, so color is an interesting thing in regards to television because... Oh, you used to be on Nick at Night. Color television went farther back than most people think with NBC. Yeah. Because uh, they were in owned by... color. They were owned by RCA, who and made the to color tele television. Who invented the color television yeah. that they used. Um. Brought to you in living color on NBC. Um, but yeah, it was from 1964 to 1967. Lost in Random versus the Immortals of Avium. And it was on NBC, so yeah, that's why it was always in color. Majority of underwater scenes were black and white stock science. <laughs> really? Okay. That's weird. Look at this. Two, two new games. Two 2020 games going up against one another. Yeah, I bet I bet you, especially back then, it would be really hard to film underwater. <laughs> I'd have to look them up. Eight to one. All right, that's where we'll stop for now. And we'll do some more later on. Uh, Final Fantasy, Mystic Quest, Armored Core... Monster Hunter Stories, Duke Nukem, Tomba, Moonwalker, and Croc 2 and Hitman. Right. They call him Flipper. Flipper. Dun, 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 dun. All right. We're on this gar gar gargantuan controller. It was... Uh... It was in the top 25 in its debut year. Oh, right. Flipper? Yeah. But okay. it was up against Jackie Gleason's show, so. All right. We're on the last level of this world. And it looks like a lava world. Hey, I've got rumble. And I wasn't, I was looking at chat. Oh, I guess I got to not be hit by those. Oh, I can... I can suck them in. Oh, wow. The voice of Flipper was actually a, 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 the song of a bird. How oh, was it? The Kukabera bird. Which is native to Australia and New Guinea. Okay, I did not expect that to happen. Filmed in Miami. It was? E Biscayne, Florida, Nassau occasionally, in cooperation with the Miami Seaquarium. Fuck. Okay, what's your question? <laughs> hey, Zach. 
a question. Whoa. Oh, 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 what's going on? Why am I? Oh, it was moving. Um, I, I don't know if he will let you do that or not. Uh, no, no, um, no advertising. That's usually kind of a standard thing on Twitch. You did. If you think about it. That's cool. I will check. I will. Uh, I will give you a follow. Pause. I noticed you changed your name. You've you've lost the C, and gained a K. What do you, uh, there you go. Oh, that's cool. What? Uh, the dolphin trainer who trained the five female dolphins who played flip. There were more than one flipper. Well, there were actually six dolphins, four, five female dolphins. They used females because they're less aggressive and didn't have as many scars on their skin because uh, they didn't get, you know, into as much mischief. Yeah. Uh, but th there was a, a trick that Flipper did, which was basically a tail walk. Yeah. Like they walk on their tail. And that was a male dolphin named Clown. Uh, but evidently the dolphin trainer ran an extension cord uh, down to the tank and so that the dolphins who acted in Flipper could see themselves on when the shows were screened on television. <laughs> and he said they were very self-aware. Well, I mean, that means they're just like everybody else male. Everything male. Huh. Oh, do, will they hump everything? They call him Flipper Flipper faster than the lightning. No one you see is smarter than he. And we know Flipper lives in a world full of wonder. Hidden under under the sea. <laughs> Those are the the lyrics. Thank you. It's going all right, shaky dog. Although I, I keep I keep getting burned. I don't like getting burned. And I like, I like that they say more like this and they give you Lassie, Mr. Ed, and Dennis the Menace. Well, I, I feel like they were all on, like uh, Oceanic was saying, on Nick at Night at one point. Well, I mean, all old television that was available was on Nick at Night at one point? Yeah. I mean, they started with that kind of stuff, that older stuff, and then slowly over time, I knew that I was old when Nick at Night was like shows from the 80s. Because it started out with like shows from the 50s and 60s. How is this helpful? That was close. <laughs> Flip Flipper was a television show Here in the, the mid-1960s 
airing on NBC in color, starring a dolphin named Flipper, uh, which was fiction because it was five female dolphins and another male dolphin. And it was the story of like uh, a, a father and a boy and their friend Flipper. I, I yes, I would watch the Carol Burnett show if that if they put that back on television, even if it was just reruns of what it was, because some of that was the funniest television ever made. That's funny. So this combination basically lights Kirby's hair on fire. Kirby doesn't have hair, does he? Playing an entirely different part Kirby than I remember. Yeah, this one. Not Mr. Ed. The famous Mr. Ed. I didn't like Mr. Ed when I was a kid. Like, it just seemed like stupid to me then. <laughs> <laughs> like, I don't want to see a horse. That was close. Oh, Gentle Ben, yeah. Get Smart was good. The show uh, from that period that I never liked, and it was on for a long, long time, was My Three Sons. I don't even like that music. Like, <laughs> uh, that was an instant channel change when that music started to come on. Why did I do that again? I didn't like this one either. When we were kids, you saw a lot of those shows, but the ones you saw the most probably were like Bewitched and I Dream of Genie and Get Smart. You always saw the Honeymooners. Like that was that's been on forever, like all the time, or the or, or uh, come on, I love Lucy. I love Lucy was pretty much always playing. Thanks for following. Ah, you know what? You can't when you have your sword out. You have to get down to wait. The sword won't go away. I have the power. Oh. Wait. Oh. Okay. That's how you put it away. Put the sword away. Well, you can't fly when you have the sword out, which I guess makes sense. Why didn't he just auto put it away? Because that would be helpful to the user. This is Nintendo. <laughs> and everything has to be persnickety as fuck. Oh. The dehumidifier's full again. Yeah, leave it to Beaver and Dick Van Dyke, yeah. Penis Van Lesbian? <laughs> I'm trying to remember show that came on the afternoon when I was a little kid and like Voltron I've seen it Defender I've seen it since and it makes more sense as an adult than it did when I was a little kid now I remember what it was Barney Miller because my mom always watched it oh Barney Miller yeah. Barney Miller yeah I guess I guess like I remember the Jeffersons being on regular television and different strokes and yeah the Andy Griffith show has basically been on since it 
running on in syndication forever. What am I supposed to do here? It's funny, a lot of that stuff that was always sort of playing through our lives is hard to find now. Oh, I, and I remember you, like on Sunday morning, they always wanted to show something like Wagon Train. Uh-oh. Which Wagon Train was oh, stupid. No. Ah. Ah. Oh, yeah, Silver Spoons and Family Ties. Yeah, I remember that. We watched the Cosby show. It's hard to admit now. <laughs> Crap. I, I would love it when they would run the Adams Family on, like, syndicated TV. This isn't the way lava works. The tidy boy? The, but putting, putting creatures on there is just mean. Run, Kirby. Wow, I can't believe I got through there. Holy shit. The monsters, yeah. Well, it's funny, there were always Ooh, a... Oh there no. were, there were all that happened a lot in the 60s two shows that were basically the same oh come on Yeah, I guess the, that's a game over. The original Scooby-Doo was like one of the best things ever. Yep. Yeah, uh, we're dropping frames. Yeah, it just it kind of spun yeah, for me. It's us. Yeet Spectrum. <laughs> yeah, we're getting... It's recovering, but it's still... I mean, it makes no sense. Why? I mean, we got, what, 40 up <laughs> now? And we can't even get five ridiculous ridiculous so sorry for the buffering i mean you know we have no control after it gets out of spectrum right? yeah i know i know and and who knows where where the server connect. is it's probably in outer mongolia or something yeah no it's us it's us buffering Yeah, we have 40 now, I think. Isn't that what we we got? Yeah. We got one gig down, 40 up. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Sporectum? <laughs> ah. Well, we canceled... We canceled our uh, television package because we never watch television anymore. And uh, and and so I said, well, you know, we're gonna relieve a lot. I want to say like 120 bucks a month. We can spend 20 bucks a month on extra internet. Maybe it'll solve our upload problems. Nope. Still the same problems.
Oh, fuck. <laughs> Don't like this. Hey, pass. Big hit down. Just the volcano one? That's terrible. Yeah, yeah, we're still dropping frames. It's terrible. Yeah, no, I wish we could get fiber. It'd be much better. Yeah. We really? I figured we had the worst internet. Because our infrastructure is so old. suck up things and spit them. I'm not going to swallow. I'm just going to spit. Come on, King Dee 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 Dee. Let's -a go. Oh, how to dodge that stuff, King D D D. Throw that. Yeah, that would be cool if Mario and Bowser had this type of relationship. We know Bowser rides Luigi, but... He throws me. I did it again. Yes, I did it again. The, the this thing is a rock. The tank is 1.14 gallon. Okay. I've emptied it twice today. It says it can. It says it can remove 120 pints per day. Oh, uh. um. Well, that would be 60 quart. That's 15 gallons of water a day.
we're still dropping frames. Sorry about it. I why? I'll look, I'll look at the router. See if it's internal to the house. Cross will make you jump, jump. Oh, this is the hair on fire one. Ugh. Why do they have to be so useless? I guess they're doing like a little fire dance, is what they're doing. And that's why there's like a wall of lava happening. Why aren't you moving? A little bit funny. Well, no, I saw I saw basically drop down. You drop down like oh, almost to. It's recovered now. Almost to zero. Yeah. Like a couple. Like it, it was looked like a W. Um, but on download, it spiked for you on both sides of the W. Okay. Uh. Did you do it? I have not worked on Fry's Quest. I've been so busy. We're, we're, uh, we're moving one of our daughters into the, into the dorm on Friday. And so we've been busy, uh, uh, doing that. So I have not worked on it. I, I probably will get some work on it maybe on Friday before we go, but maybe not. I don't know. I'm also behind on, we've been going through games so fast. It's been hard to, to uh, catch up on stuff for the stream. I'm hoping I'm hoping to have um, some uh, some time eventually to work on it. I do miss working on it. I, I enjoy it a lot. Come on. I think what's frustrating about this is I keep like it's controller problems like it's so far out we're just we're just going We got out of it. Wow. We actually said, what's a mystery? Oh, there's a mystery. We got to get the mystery. What's the mystery? What is it? What? What was the mystery? What was that? Oh, yeah, I totally, it gets in the way. Yeah. What is going on here? 
Oh, I see. He's got... Oh, he's got... Oh, he hurt me. Okay. Figure out a solution for that. Ah! Come on! I don't think I got anything. Thank you! No oh, thanks, Neil. <laughs> what, four years? Is it four years? 48 months. It's 48 months, four years. Oh, no. Why does it have to be a lava creature? Why can't he be dead? Oh, he's got a second phase. Lava penises? <laughs> what? I didn't even hit me. I just kind of just died. And here's a monster where you just die. <sighs> Can't believe, Neil, we've known each other for 48 months. Cool. <laughs> Neil was my first subscriber, and that's why I married him. It's not we were, true. We were already married. We were already married. <laughs> That was a joke. I think you remember it right. He did. I can't believe he bitch slaps me like that. I should have sucked those up. That's I wasn't thinking. Kind of disturbing. What? He's in my space. He's in my my personal space. I should have sucked them up too. You can't suck everyone. I know. Oh, I must have to hit him in the face. Not the face. Hit him in the face. I'm kind of surprised that didn't get a quote. Yeah. You can't suck everyone. <laughs> there you go. There you go. Oh shit! I was, I was too, too busy. <laughs> Sorry, I wasn't trying to solicit that or anything. I just like surprised. Usually, anything that can be double entendre. What? Dude, that's not fair. What was I supposed to do there? I can't tell you. Oh. I don't know. What, maybe get close to him? It goes over my head? Oh, fuck. Come on. Oh no, Avon's filing for bankruptcy. Avon? Really? Avon, Avon, yeah. Avon calling?
One more. Oh, fuck. I didn't mean to. Got him. Yeah, it does have kind of like this or whatever dancing music there, doesn't it? Let's go get close to him in case he breathes in. So, Alright, that's the solution. Get close to him. Yeah, see, hitting him with double does twice as much damage. Yeah, I should have run. Oh, one more hit. Well, they're probably like, what can we do with this, with these graphics? <laughs> All right. Catch you later, shaky dog. I think so. I think there's still one more world. The Shiver Star? Hi. You know what? Let's look. <laughs> Kirby and the Crystal Ship. Welcome, Big Wolf Foz. Oh, it's got... I see. Well, why didn't it hurt? Fire. Kind of hard to see those stars up against... Catching the penguin? I thought the penguin had a crystal shard for a second. 
is there a, tr a story to the crystal shards um i don't there's like this black dark energy that kind of is possessing these things and there was like some fairy and you're trying to get the crystal shards back for the fairy people something like that Kirby does some Kirby stuff. Oh, I see. I'm falling when I spike. When I'm a spiky. Like the white snow. Uh oh, we're tobogging. Kirby does Kirby stuff. Oh, I, I thought I jumped. Oh, I didn't hit the right button. Look at that, we went over the tunnel. Oh, well, that's a problem. We died. <laughs> Metroid head? Neil, you want to get the Metroid head for me? Sure. You didn't feel comfortable clipping it to my head? I thought I would distract you. Got a crystal shard! Couldn't jump over that one. Hey, Flaming Bigot. Remember when we were playing a Kirby game and, um, uh, what's his name, Shed? <laughs> uh, Metroid? Hold on just a second. Am I on the right scene? That seems cut off. I guess it is. going on here um I can't tell you well it was just like a giant oh he was a boss I didn't realize he was a boss I was like why am I not killing this guy Nintendo Bing. Yeah, I feel like I'm cutting off the bottom and the top of the screen. That's weird. Right, let's try this again. Oh, that's it. That's the problem. Actually, I see the problem. I'm not using... I'm using my SNES... I, I forgot what system I'm on. I'm not on the SNES. I'm on the N64. There we go. There we go. We can see everything. Oh yeah, we saw Samus too. We saw a, a Metroid and Samus. We saw both of them.
I got it. How's it's going? Julio. Hey, Julio. How was truck driving? I already knew what you were playing. Oh, I figured he was still super smart. Sh no, super no, sucking. he's been doing American Truck Simulator, and he's got these glasses. He's got a trucker-like glasses. Hilarious. Oh, maybe that's the clip that'll play. Well, welcome, everybody. How's it going? I hope you all had a, had a fun time over at Chileo. Hope you'll stick around here. Uh, we're playing some Kirby 64, the Crystal Shards. <laughs> we're doing well, doing well. Hope you're doing all right. How was how was truck driving? Did you uh, did you deliver everything on time? You did <laughs> did some good ones tonight. Okay. Do you do you speak on the walk on the, not the walkie talkie? What was that called? The CB radio. When you're on, when you're you're trucking, breaker breaker one nine. Yeah, breaker breaker one nine. What? How did that go? I, I got a smoky that, on my tail, and that's uh, well. I mean, you would. That's yeah. there is no preset sentence in CB lingo, but you would start with breaker breaker. Yeah, and the channel. But you would go into the channel, <laughs> like you were breaking uh, the conversation. Uh huh. Indicating your presence. Oh, I see. I see. You had one massive head on. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, those videos where they uh, use that game, uh, that, not that that it's a game, I guess, where they simulate vehicles, uh -huh. uh, like any kind of vehicle. Oh yeah, yeah. You take two any vehicles and you can collide them, and, and, and then they, yeah. And, and they, then see they, what happens. They, they, it's like a simulation. They, yeah, and there are hundreds of YouTube videos where they just crash them. Yeah, yeah. Well, welcome, everybody. We play a lot of retro variety here, uh, a lot of series. We're working on the Kirby series. Um, play a, uh, games off my arcade machine. Uh, we play a game, an RPG called Fry's Quest, which we're actually going to do in about 15 minutes. Um, but yeah, welcome. Let's play... Let's play a clip from Chulio's stream. I am not typing in the right spot. And y'all should go give him a follow. Please type in the right spot. Here he is. See his glasses? Uh, I am thinking about more of that chicken right now. <laughs> yeah, this is it's like so it. lovely. Tastes so good and crispy, so warm and fresh. <laughs> you know, you should put you should put your camera on the other side, and then it's like your the rear view mirror, and we're seeing you in the rear view mirror. Oh, well, that's a pretty good idea. Yeah. Nice job, honey. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, thanks again uh, for the raid. Of course. All right. Okay, I did everything. Was where's the too, Where's the that, N64 controller? Was that too much? No, no. <laughs> again, thank you for for uh, resubscribing, Neil. Forty eight months. I can't believe it. Yeah. <laughs> Every month I go in and check that Amazon Prime check. Yeah. What if they stop doing that? Um, I don't know. I guess I won't be subscribing, and I'll be <laughs> complaining about ads. I don't think they're going to get rid of it, but... I don't either. I don't think it costs them anything, really. Uh, yeah, I don't really think it costs them much any either. It kind of encourages there people. Pr there are probably enough people that aren't subscribing to Twitch. Yeah. They don't have to put. They don't have to make people pay extra for ads. Yeah. Like, uh, like they do for the actual Prime Video. <laughs> that was 
class. I don't understand what he he's like a bomb. He's like a pipe bomb, I guess, because he's got pipes. Oh, those birds look terrible. Everything is kind of angular because they didn't have many polygons on these things. This mountainside looks like a waffle. A waffle? Like a waffle cone yeah, or something? Yeah, it does look like a waffle cone. Uh-oh, I'm falling. Catch me, I'm falling. It's, <laughs> it's, it's too bad we, we couldn't have just have, like, had no gaming through this period. And... Um, and they come out on the other side and they can actually do something. <laughs> okay, here we go. The toboggan again. Oh, oh crap. Because that's, that's probably how we got, like, Superman 64. <laughs> and let's, let's all be truthful to ourselves. That should have never happened. Superman 64. Yeah, it is pretty bad. It is so incredibly bad. And it's not even, like, hilariously bad or, you know, bad in any kind of good way. Yeah. It's bad in all the wrong ways. <laughs> it's not like the room where you can watch the room and yeah. gain some enjoyment out of the entire oh, right. this is... posturous nature of it. Hey, Green Bear. Howdy, howdy. It's going well. We're just spiking this uh, boss. Spike them. Fire and bomb for fireworks. Yes. <laughs> well, this was a new one. I had never done this one before. Bomb and spikes. Ooh. I can't get him when he's when I, what he's trying to do when he's constipated or something. Oh, there's stuff underwater. There is stuff underwater. How do I get down there? Um. Can you spike and jump at the same time? I can't. They watch. Well, I meant maybe if you do that on the ice. You'll oh, you know what? Look, there's this hole. Or there's a hole. And now I'm underwater. Don't drown. Kirby doesn't drown. F drowns. <laughs> your, your whispering will not be caught, uh, picked up. I said everyone drowns. Uh back here. Okay, I guess that's as far as you can go. But we had fun. Interesting, you can kind of. There's stuff along the safe zone on the edge of the screen. <laughs> A shark! Look at the shark.
course. Of course we're gonna hit that. Of course. Like I can't get him to be loud enough and then he yells into the microphone the was that, the, uh, that wasn't even yelling. That wasn't the, even um, uh, Omaha. That was Mutual, mutual of, Omaha. of Omaha. Wild Kingdom, Wild I think. Kingdom. And that wasn't even that loud. You're overreacting. I'm, you're, you're being uh, a, a diva. How do you have to be such a diva? Ow! They're not really hurting you. They are hurting me. I feel it. I feel it. I feel all the pain. Is it my imagination or did the cost of digital cameras go up like thousand dollars over the last ten years? But that doesn't make any sense too, because like everyone has a phone, and I I would I would assume most people use their phone. Well, I I think what's happened is is the phone has taken out the sort of middle market. Uh. Sort of like the point and shoot category. Penguin from afar. I saw that coming. Dangle a star over an edge. You think that's not going to hurt me? What are those mystery cards? They didn't tell me, so I'm not going to go for them. Those are the worst looking snake things I've ever seen. <laughs> like, what? We got, we got two. That's not too bad. What did they think they were doing? I have no idea. The Rumble Pack is secretly a shock tool when Kirby gets hurt. That's true. It's, it's actually hooked up to my finger. Oh, it's a bestiary. Oh, okay. Okay. I don't care about that. I care about lives. I wanted it to be five lives. Oh. Or like on a jelly donut. What? We're going into the sky anus. Oh. Look like a zit. <laughs> Speak for yourself, Dark Passenger. Episode of the Flintstones where like Fred and Barney became popular musicians for one show. I thought you were gonna say prostitutes. No, that never happened. Um say? But they did some song and the the chorus of it was twitch twitch. But that's what oh, I yeah, think I remember of. that. That's what I think of every time 
I hear something talking about Twitch. You're going to eat his asshole? No, I ate him because he was an asshole. Oh. Ah. It was too good. I had to do it. <laughs> of course. Oh, that was mean. I hate dying the same way twice. That's what I hate. So close to the end, too. Oh, my.
Not happy about that. Well, I guess we start later in the level. Yeah, this is the heat seeking missiles. going on with those faces on that thing. They're homing missiles, but they can't seem to home in on those birds, whatever they are. I totally saw that and I thought it was like some sort of like, I thought it was like a crystal shark. not fair I was shooting it oh my god they come from above now too get me out of here I wasn't doing that right. the most boring boss ever. He's got like a smile on his face the whole time. Kind of creepy. Oh my goodness. Oh wait. Now I have to probably have to have electricity. This is this is this is just wrong. It's just mean. We're gonna dangle this shard in front of you. This is why this game does not deserve to be a hundred percented. Because it's just mean. You're, you're muted, by the way, Neil. Did they not offer you what you needed 
in front of that boss? Nope, not in the boss chamber. Maybe earlier in the level, and you had to not oh, die. Oh, all the ones I've played, they put whatever it was that in you the room. Did. No, not in the room. Oh. Right before it. Oh, right before it. Yeah. So if you picked the wrong one, you would be able yeah. to. Yeah. Exclamation mark! Join if you'd like to play some Fry's Quest. Ready for action. Woohoo! Let's do this! Can't believe how fast we're getting through these games. I reformulated my potions with 25% less lead. Hey, Salty. Ready for action. If I didn't already say that. Hey, Salty. <laughs> You're still <laughs> muted, Neil. <laughs> Hello, everyone. We love having you here. How can I help you with that? Do I need, like, flashing light on the microphone? Well, that's the problem, is the light flashes when it's muted. Yeah, you think it should, you, you, he has this, he thinks it should be the other way around. It should, well, what it should do is it should either light up, uh-huh, ready for action, or not. Ready for action. I or guess you could, you typically, could typically something that's more prone to attract your, your, your attention mm -hmm. is what's live. One thing you could do is leave Sonobus so you could see it, and then you could see maybe your levels or something. Flashing is muted, solid is on. Yeah. You know, they do have microphones where the whole microphone lights up. Would that help? <laughs> Time's up. Have fun watching the floor. Um. <laughs> I know. That's basically the look he gave me. That's the look he gave me. I don't have the ability. Well, his, he likes his, to tell he likes he, to tell me about my looks. Yeah, yeah. Oh, he has a lot of looks. Anyway, all right, I'll be right back. Don't go anywhere.
welcome to Neil's Deals. We're fresh out of lore. Those monsters stole me lucky charms. Ready for action. Ready for battle. Ready for battle. Today is a good ready day for to battle. battle. Good luck. You'll certainly need it.
having a special today. On nothing! Let's do this! Those Ready monsters stole me lucky charms! Ready for battle. Ready for action. Ready for battle. Time's up. Have fun watching the floor.
Why, hello there. Fancy meeting you here. Sucking my brain. Murder World? <laughs> J Fries, aka Murder World. I guess you're right. Shipwreck, Cobra, and Salty all dead. Dead, I tell you. Oh. For what? Oh, what uh, do the abbreviations under the enemy hit points mean? Oh, okay. You're right. I don't ex explain that. I should do that. Um, what? Well, congrats, Oceanic. So uh, P-R-O-T stands for protection. And so protection can be um, basically the higher the number, the more protection they have. Um, and so they, then they're harder to hit. And then uh, the next one is their chance to hit protection 10. THP stands for to hit protection 10. And then so you can see the platinum dragon in the lower right-hand corner has a 65% chance of hitting protection 10. So if you have protection 10, that's the chance that they have to hit you. So you can see like the iron golem has an 85% chance. So they have a higher chance of hitting you um and so yeah you, you can kind of get a sense of what you know if you have more protection they have less chance and, and stuff like that but yeah let me uh write that down to explain what those mean uh do, 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 do. explain monster info on Price quest. Yeah, so yeah, you could you could that would could be a strategy there is attacking stuff that has a chi higher chance to hit you. That's that's a good one. Iron golems are good to hit first just because they do a lot of damage, I would say. Um, if you weren't here earlier, we have started the vote again. So we're doing a, a like a big March Madness style voting system where we basically say this game or this game, this game or this game. And so we've started it all over again. Exactly. You should use protection. Yes, you really should. <laughs> and so uh, obviously we're going to continue the Kirby series. We're going to get all the way up to the Wii. We got a GBA, a DS and a Wii game to play. We are past. I have been blowing through these games like no tomorrow. So we have already started uh, the vote again. And here's our first matchup already. Yeah. New Gosh. All right, we have fantasy uh fan. Oh, I, I was going to say that. that's not spelled correctly. Fantasy Mystic Quest and Armored or Welcome to Fantasy Island. Yeah, I know. <laughs> good, good job, Salty, of, of recognizing that. Name that tune there. But yeah, use the Twitch interface to vote. <laughs> he was so weird. He was. Didn't he do it recently, too? Wasn't there, like, a video of him? I mean, he, he yeah. Like, singing I, that I song. I forget recently. what his name is. Yeah. Uh... 
And I forget what the name of the song is. I know I've looked yeah. it up. Yeah, he's still around. I think he he formed at the Olympics in Russia, the Winter Olympics in Russia. I was gonna say in was Paris. It, was it Sochi? I think. All right, Fantasy Mystic Quest. Oops, not 93. <laughs> Nine, two, three. Okay, the next one, Monster Hunter Stories and the original Duke Nukem, not Duke Nukem 3D, Duke Nukem. Monster Hunter Stories. Duke Nukem. I've never played the original Duke Nukem. I've played Duke Nukem 3D. The only one I've ever played. Yes, I didn't even Vitus, play Duke Nukem Vitus 4 ever. Alright, what, Neil? I was talking. Vitus is the guy's name. Ah, okay. And I th Was it the seventh element, I think? What's the name of this tune? Fifth element, says Salty. Fifth. Fifth element. Uh, yeah, that's the movie. <laughs> Salty says, wait, oh, that's the movie. Which we played no, it's on. This, it's the seventh element. Seventh element. And uh, we played fifth element on the uh, on Worst Game Wednesday. It's hard to remember, you know, your elements. What is the seventh element? Your mom. <laughs> I meant on the periodic table. Um, I don't know. Is it oxygen? All right, Duke Nuka moves on. Slesium. <laughs> All right, so we have Omba. Nitrogen. nitrogen. Nitrogen is the seventh element. Versus Moonwalker. Oh, we've got a raid. We got a raid. Oh, and I and we started the 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 thing. Hey, top red bear, welcome everybody. We're doing it. We're doing a vote right now in the um, in the chat on uh, which game I should be playing first. Tomba on. Oh, thanks for following. Or Moonwalker, if you want to participate. Did you do a shout out? Yes. All right, Diablo 4. Nice. Well, the original Diablo is somewhere on this list. Uh, and so basically this is how we're determining which game I should play next. Because uh, we're running out of games to play. <laughs> we, I usually play them like in eight era, you know, eight games and then and then move on to the next one. So well, welcome. Oh, you did that too? You played the first one? So I, that's kind of what I do here. I play a lot of series. So like right now we're we're working on the Kirby series and I'm on Kirby 64, uh, the Crystal Shards. shards. Um, Moonwalker. All right. I will, I will record that. 7 to 1. Um, and yeah. So welcome in everyone. I'm Jay Fries. Play a lot of retro variety. We play games off my arcade machine. And uh, we just finished playing a game called Fry's Quest, which is a game I wrote, which allows up to eight people from chat to play uh, in an RPG style game. But welcome. Like I said, we're, we're in the middle of doing a vote. Uh, let me real quick record the results of this one. So it was Tomba 1, Moonwalker 7. And so basically how I do my streams is I do games in groups of eight. So like this. And so I'm working on a series like Kirby and then, um, there's a channel point redemption where I'll spin a wheel and pick one off of that. And then we're voting for all the ones on the bottom. And then I just kind of do a zigzag through this group of eight, eight games. And then we, do it all again after eight games. I've played a lot of short games, like games I can finish in one or two streams. Like these Kirby games are quick. In fact, I think we're we're almost done with this game. And we've only been playing it for a few hours. 
Well, we played a little bit yesterday. So, two streams and we're done. So, it's been nice. It's been a nice... We played a lot of RPGs last, last time. Like Dragon Warrior and Final Fantasy... Which one was that? Six? Yeah, Final Fantasy VI. Dragon Warrior Two, And so, it was nice to kind of like play some quick platformers. Although, I guess Donkey Kong Country 2 was pretty, pretty vicious, but... Uh, Top Red Bear, is it cool if I play a clip? May I play a clip from your stream? Anyway, that's that's how we that's how we that's how we roll here. Just like that. Actually, what I'll do is. A little mutter stuff. Okay. <laughs> what are you talking about? Of course it exists. Look at it. It's a Metroid. Isn't it cute? It's a cute little Metroid. Okay, you want me to not play a clip. All right, that's cool. Cute little Metroid. It is cute. I look at, I mean, it's all stitched and stuff. Yeah, there you go, Dark Passenger. <laughs> Those are pretty cute Metroids, too. Kind of funny when you think about what Metroid... And you think about crochet. Yeah. It makes you think some grandmother made that. Yeah. You say cuss words. That's fine if it's okay. <laughs> I get it. Yeah. yeah, see, I'm going to uh, keep licking him till he dies. See, that's the type of stuff we can say. Yeah, that's fine. I don't mind it. All right, here we go. All right, y'all should go give Top Red Bear a follow. Gags. You can also carry them in your inventory and switch them out when you need. Hey, Dark, how you doing, brother? Thank you for joining me. I started a new game today. Um, literally just starting out. Um... Yeah, it's, um, the crafting is okay. The building of the base. What game? Enshrouded. Okay. Yeah, I, I couldn't read it. The, the lettering was so tiny. That's the other clip, but that's cool. <laughs> hey, I have no control with clip it plays. Enshrouded. All right, cool. Well, thanks again. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks for bringing everyone over. Um, all right, let's do, let's do a little bit more voting. So yeah, one of the games I played last time was, or was that the time before, was Croc 2, or Croc, the original Croc. So now we have Croc 2. <laughs> Damn, I can't talk tonight. And Hitman. So in chat, go ahead and vote on that one. And we'll do one more after this. Thanks for the lurk. Thanks again for the raid. One croc was enough. <laughs> it was a tough game. It was fun, though. It, uh, I got some pretty good clips out of it. My heart. <laughs> Duck, what duck? Oh, I see what you're saying. <laughs> what are you talking about? There's nothing on my head. Why? Why would you say that? <laughs> Hitman. No more croc. Two. Oops. Six. All right, one last one, and we will move on. We have the RPG Blue Dragon. Blue Dragon versus the original Doom. We're going to play it on an electric toothbrush. No, I'm joking. We're just going to play it on the PC. 
the regular version, not the Stream Deck version. Ooh, I wonder if anyone has put Doom on the Stream Deck. You could totally do that. <laughs> he didn't like, uh, yeah, yeah. The camera and the movement was pretty crazy. I mean, those old 3D RP, uh, um, platformers were, were kind of tough. But it feels so good when you beat them. I noticed you didn't put sharts on your YouTube video. Sharts? Yeah, you put the crystal shards. Shards. Yeah. That's the name of the game. Yeah. Well, that wasn't what you were calling it last night. No, I, I just call it uh, the crystal shard. Shards. Meow. Meow. All right. Doom is the winner. All right, that's so we're we're still in the first round. We've got a long way to go. Oh, there's true crime. Can't remember who was wanting me to put that on there. Well, it's on there. Yeah, you'll, you'll notice a lot of the new games that uh, y'all wanted me to play are on there. All right, let's get back to the Kirby. Get back to the Kirby. I actually think we're close to the end of this game. Honestly. But we'll see. It seems quiet. I turned it up. Okay, well that seems weird. <clears throat> hey, Julia. Welcome back. Okay, well, there you go. Are we in a mall? You never know where you'll end up in a Kirby game. Oh, the throwing stars. I love the throwing stars. Can't seem to hit anything with the stars, but I love them. Can I go up here? Get some food? Play two games at the same time? Oh, the list? It's it's about 150. So. It goes on forever. It's a pretty long list. How could I not see that? I think I'm blind? are in a mall. Why are we all of a sudden in a mall? I think malls did not go away in Japan like they did here. Well, I mean, also, well, this game's from, I think, the year 2000, so malls were still around back then. That's true. Fool me with those eyes glaring out of the cave. Ooh. 
Ooh, arcade mode. What would you like me to play on the arcade mode? <gasps> oh man, I'm already being tortured. What are you talking about? Oh no, 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 I'm gonna lose my throwing stars! I wish I could kill those things. <laughs> Haunted Castle? Alright. I'm gonna beat Medusa one of these days. I am. Good luck with that. Okay, Bear? I can't believe it. 34 months. Yeah, let's see. Yeah, we're getting close. What would that be? 36 would be, would be four babies. Which babies? Amazing. What is it? Bomb, cherry, grape? Or maybe orange, cherry, grape? Are you telling me something? Orange, cherry, grape? How do I? How do I? I can't I do anything. Ah, okay. I gotta push down. My orange, cherry, right. That I got it. Can I go back? Orange, cherry, right. How about we do it backwards? Great. Very. Orange. Oh, you think maybe that's a lemon? Yeah. You think that's a uh, green? Okay, green, red, green, red, uh, purple. Green, red, yep, that was it. I wonder what that was. What's a green fruit? And then I died. <laughs> not a durian, that's true, it's not a durian. <laughs> a lime? It didn't look very lime-like. Oh, I lost my ability. Not too happy about that. Oh fuck, that instant killed me! No, we changed it, RK Bear. We thought it would be more interesting to try it this way. Like actually counting how many deaths. Wow. 
What the fuck? Just wrong. Mean. All right. Pass VGC wants me to play Haunted Castle in <laughs> arcade mode. There we go. That was a burp. I had it I had it built up and I was like, I am gonna burp arcade mode. And and that that's what y'all got. You got the burping of arcade mode. Alright, Haunted Castle having nothing to do with uh Castlevania. It has no relation whatsoever to Castlevania. It is not Castlevania. It is Haunted Castle. Do not forget that. Whoops. <laughs> I actually don't burp on stream. But that one was building right right then and so I was like I'm going for it I am gonna burp all right there we go all right shall we do it Dracula is such a cock blocker we we're married Oh no, it's Dracula gonna steal my girlfriend!
I hated that 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 uh, there was that statue that crumbled and took half of my health. <laughs> you lose, big guy. I was guy. so close. Hey, Tom, Tom, how's it going? Welcome, welcome. <laughs> you lose. All right, shall we try it again? Shall we try it again? I was on a... I was on a roll. <laughs> it's doing it's I'm going and doing well over here. I was doing so well. I was rocking those bats. No hits and then that statue killed me or it took half of my health. All right, let's try it again. Yeah, this is this is a game called Haunted Castle and it it's basically I don't even know why it's called Haunted Castle. It should totally be called Castle. I mean, look, it's by Konami. You could have called it Castlevania. It has the it has the the screen, the the starting screen of Castlevania. Maybe they But yet they, they called it Haunted Castle. Maybe they thought they were fooling someone. Well, may, yeah, I mean, maybe they they figured um this Castlevania would, would get them nowhere on arcade games or something. Well, it was 1988. Isn't that around yeah. the time Castlevania came out? Yeah. yeah. Uh, I mean, Castlevania on NES didn't look this good, did it? No. No, no. Yeah. So it was probably they were not trying the two, to tie the two together. Yeah. Did it come out in 87? So Castlevania was already out. Yeah, but it wouldn't have really made a name for itself. Yeah. yeah. Well, it would have... Um, wouldn't have had a character that looks that walks like he has a stick up his butt. Well, I mean, there are a lot of video game characters that do that. That's a good question. Yeah, do do some research. I mean, it's obviously. I mean, there's Konami. It says Konami right there. That's all I was going off of right there. Can you can you use the Konami code? I I have no idea. 
There's not really a start button. Um, all right, let's play it again. Yeah, I've been trying to ch do another uh, uh, another kind of strategy there. I used to try the bombs, and it was not very good. It had the same name as Castlevania series in Japan. Hmm. Arcade division and the console division had communication. <laughs> exactly. Maybe they didn't talk to one another. All right, let's try it one more time. Yeah, maybe the console division uh, wouldn't license the name to the arcade division. It's all about P and L.
It's amusing to me that you think an arcade game <laughs> It's would... coming out of nowhere and killing you. Yes, because they want you to put it in another quarter. <laughs> also, like, it didn't heal me all the way. That's just mean. This game is mean. It is a mean game. I'm going on record to saying this game is mean. <laughs> You're like, they wanted you to put quarters in. I mean, you, if anyone, should understand... The business of it's making me. money. Well, actually, in the 80s, a lot of video games were, were used to launder money. Yeah. That's why your, your dad didn't want you to play video games, arcade games. Oh, no. My, my dad, uh, I remember him stopping. So there was a, where we would go for pizza, which was where I interacted with most arcade games. Uh, we had to go... A, a bit of a distance away because we didn't live near anything and uh i'd say it's a, it was about 15 or 20 minutes yeah. um but what you cr you would cross uh this river but it was basically a swamp and so like you would go down and cross the swamp on this flat piece and then go up the hill to where the pizza place was and uh, he stopped. The, I was asking him if I could play some games, you know, if he'd give me some quarters. And he just, like, stopped on the road and handed me two quarters and, like, throw them out into the swamp because that's all the good it'll do for you. Dad had anger problems. I mean, he wasn't really super angry. Everyone that raises their voice isn't super angry, Sugar. I mean, they would give me some. They would let me do some of it, but it was... It wasn't easy. He is. He's just really into wrestling. He's very passionate. Well, I mean, that was all an act. I mean, professional wrestling is soap operas for men. I mean, it's, it's, it's real in that they can hurt themselves. And I, I don't think they ever mean to, but I mean, they, they, they do and they do work out in gyms all the time, but like the matches are pretty scripted. Next he's going to say Santa Claus isn't real. Well, I hate to tell you. <laughs> Indie Wrestling League, huh? Well, I mean, my thought on it is this, the storylines in those things, because, you know, they sort of weave a story into the match. And the storylines are, you know, pretty similar all the time. And they are much like soap opera story, like where you have the same story all the time. They're different. You think orange, yellow, red?
Yes, that's what I believe I was saying. Shocked. Ready for a new challenger. How's it going, everyone? What were you up to? Zero escape. Zero time dilemma. Hey, how's it going, Shellshock? How was your stream? Welcome, everybody. I'm Jay Fries, retro variety streamer. Completed recently 154 games now on Twitch. Working on 155. Kirby's. Kirby 64, not Kirby's 64. The Crystal Sharts. Made more progress. Nice. Yeah, we're making pretty good progress. I think we're near the end of the game, maybe? I'm not 100%ing it, so I'm sure it'll be terrible. A terrible. I'll get the bad ending, but okay. To a retro gaming convention over the weekend. Nice. Yes. Long Island Retro Gaming Expo. Nice. Yeah, I saw Ash uh, said hi was there. That's cool. Yeah, that's if if I was close to New York, I would go. <laughs> I don't, I've looked for gaming conventions down here. I think there is a Florida one down like in Lakeland or something like that, but I don't remember what it's called. You saw her? Nice. Um, I met her at uh, TwitchCon, and uh, I assume she'll be going to TwitchCon again this year. So, yeah, um, we're both, me and Neil are going to TwitchCon this year. So. Yep. Yeah, uh, maybe. I mean, it is on the East Coast, so that would be easier for me than flying all the way to San Diego. Um, but we'll see. Yeah, thanks. Um, you cool with... Uh, I'm pretty sure you're cool with uh, playing a, um, a clip, right? One year? Yeah. I, I had a lot of fun last year, and I'm looking forward to seeing it in uh, at San Diego. Cool. All right, here is a clip from Shellshock Prime. Y'all should go give him a follow. The reason that people that the reason that like not a lot of people really talk too much about this game is because by the time it came out, um, Turbo Mania was pretty much like was it over on the decline back in '93. Is this Street Fighter and versus the third movie being or something? A bad movie didn't help. Nice. You win! Let's go. <laughs> Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Tournament Fighters. Wow. Nice. From the SNES. Oh, cool. I'm not, I'm not very good at, at fighting games. I'm just not very good at fighting games. So I usually don't play them. They weren't, they weren't my jam. Well, thanks again for the raid. And we're going to continue. And I'm gonna try not to get hit. There's one fighting game you you play that you like better than the others, which is is it Street Fighter Two? Oh yeah, I yeah, it's because I used to play it in college, um, at the arcade. And uh, oh no, water. Oh, I can still throw my throwing stars. That's cool. Oh god, they're looking at you. Yeah, but I was never really good at Street Fighter 2. I was... okay. I just have to have stuff that's trying to get you. Why can't this just be Kirby and Peaceful Land? This one has been... Oh, evil. The worst I think I've seen. Worse than what way? Uh, and how evil it is. Uh. Boo. Yeah. 
wow, it's take me all the way back here. I swear I've gone through more doors than this. <clears throat> oh, I guess maybe it's not that far back. I forgot, I, I lost my, my ninja stars. Oh, and I hate that. I hate that they insta-kill you. That's what I don't like. We're Maybe. gonna insta-kill you. Exactly. I'm just gonna play it safe and let them drop. <clears throat> I guess I could use that. some food in there. I didn't know I could kill those. There we go. I wonder if there's a shard up in, up in here. I hope so. Fuck! Oh, my evil guy. Are you okay? I didn't like that. I'm sorry. Oh, yeah, when you, ha when you rip your face off, you can't get anything. Not the face! Bypassed it. It's like anticipating where I'm going. It knows what you're doing. <laughs> I got through it. It healed me. Oh, we got all, th we well, look at us. We got all three crystal shards. <laughs> you struggled so much when you got to this point? Well, good, good. I'm glad I can make people feel better about their, their playthroughs. <clears throat> Guess we're going down. Get down. Get up.
sandwich. What about that sandwich? Oh, fuck. scared the shit out of me. Yeah. That's true. The 2.5 is, is, is nice. I, you know, I used to say that about a lot of games is you don't have to be 3d. Like you can keep the spirit of the game and not be 3d. Damn it. Oh, this one has spirit. I think you can hammer these. Make them count. Ah! Asshole. Well, I got, I got, I got some back. I saw you coming. Don't throw me. No. Oops. Didn't tell which which direction I was facing. Is that a bird? Oh, it's in a tank of some sort. Oh, of course. Oh, God. like that you can't jump you can't fly you jump when you throw that out all you can do is jump you can't fly <laughs> well I don't need another single Yeah. Well, the camera, the de the camera is definitely kind of a thing. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Oh, I see. Is it the giant bird? The giant bird. It's the great bird of the galaxy, folks. Come to poop on us. Welcome to poop on us. Ah, crap. We got hit again. We're going to come and poop on you. Not if I poop on you first. For me to poop on. <laughs> yeah, for me. It's a bird for me to poop on. 
We're gonna use some gray poop on. I did it. Now what? Oh, I guess I have to fly. Oh, but I can't get into the, sh the shard factory. Probably had to steal its electric electricity. We're gonna dangle another. It's electric. And dangle another shard in, in your face. Have the shard. Have some Tranya. I'm sorry, I don't know why I'm just being random. You are being very random. You're excited. I'm sorry if it's disturbing anyone. So disturbing. I try. <laughs> oh, that was close. That was close. Oh, great. Hopefully, this, hopefully I fit. I do. Can't stop there. I see where we can stop. Oh my god, no. We're back in. <laughs> I know what happened. What happened? Oh no, I was watching you. You were going for that other thing and it's like, nope. Yeah. Well, that's where I had to go. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Do the do. Try Mountain Dew. Yeah. I live on the edge. Timing on that is really tough. That is a tough timing. <sighs> that's tough. Well, tough I mean, that's, timing. That's what a lot of those things are. It's just timing. Yeah. You're usually good at those. Yes, I am running. <laughs> Maybe I could run better. I mean, like, you could play run Cuphead. Faster. You could play Cuphead, and that was all timing and patterns. Yeah, it was. <clears throat> I think I need to jump. <sighs> Earlier oh, is what I was going to say. Just cross to make it. I don't know if he can. That's a good question. What was it? Yeah, yeah, that's what I was saying, yes. He can.
Oh, come on. Lost all my ability? Oh, there's a shard there. Of course there was. Oh, I got an extra guy. <laughs> totally not fair. I shouldn't have. I should have. I should not have gone for that, knowing that it would have been game over. Let's play some Fry's Quest! Exclamation mark! Join if you'd like to play some Fry's Quest. And we'll come back. We'll do a little bit of more voting. And oh, thank you, Julio. <laughs> uh, we'll play a little bit more uh, off when you spend of this, 10, and then we'll call it a night. Hopefully, we can finish it. I feel like we're near the end. I'm ready. Let's go. This store reeks of capitalism. What are you looking at, Neil? That is a small SD card. Yeah. Micro. Yeah. What about it? Oh, 32? Uh, oh, no, not quite yet. Uh, hmm. <clears throat> I remember when, if you saw Made in Korea on something, it meant it was complete total crap. <laughs> Well, well that's remember. that's changed over the years. I remember the same thing about China. Yeah, exactly. Well, it's all changed over the years, yeah. Well, that's a joke in Back to the Future. You know, he goes, Doc, every, every, all the great stuff is made in, in Japan. But, you know, Those Doc thought, stole me lucky thought charms. otherwise. It just worked. <laughs> great. Now I got it out. <laughs> I, I like how it's a kid-proof camera in Neil's program. <laughs> Any other players? No, no, it's I put it in backwards. Yeah, I figured. Uh, and it got stuck. Yeah. I had to get a screwdriver out to get the card out. Today is a good day to fry. Don't you know who my husband is? Get out of here! Alright, I'll be right back. See you in a second.
Welcome to Neil's Deals. I'm ready. Where Let's go. Gonna yeah. for reeks of capitalism. Ready for action. Ready for action. Today is a good day to fry. Ready for battle. Ready for battle. Shops closed. Have fun counting sheep.
something, will ya? Ready for action. I'm ready. Let's go. This store reeks of capitalism. Ready for battle. Those monsters stole me lucky charms! You're buying that? <laughs> Good luck! Ready for battle. Ready for action. Today is a good day to fry. We're closed. Get out of here.
Hello. How is the fighting going? Thank you, Flaming Baguette. Risking the brisket. That's how it's going. Taste the biscuit. Oh, I see. You're not going to use your potion. That's risky. Will it pay off? Will it pay off? Ooh, down to eight. Boom. Got it. You risk the biscuit. I meant the brisket. I would risk a biscuit. You crazy. Kai with a win. I do like biscuits too. We just had some croissants. Mmm, bread. All right, let's try and beat this level. Nice gravy biscuit. Oh yeah, biscuits and gravy are awesome. Okay, we gotta start this all over again. Into the... The McDonald's biscuits are usually not great. Oh. That's terrible. But yeah. You know what? There's this place that we went, used to go to, and it's like all of a sudden it said temporarily closed, and we're like, what's going on? Turns out they had a fire. There's a shard. How do you get to that shard? How do you get there? Well, maybe. There it is. How do you get there? I wonder if you have to have fire to get rid of the X's. should do there. Oh, voting! Thank you. I was so gung-ho on getting right back to the game. I forgot. Get right back to the game. I forgot about voting. Here's our next ones. Where's my pole? Can't find my pole. All right. Eternal Sonata versus True Crime LA. Let's say LA. Internal sunshine of the spotless mind. Oh, true crime in LA or Eternal Sonata? Xbox 360 versus PS2.
Yeah, we are in kind of the bottom rung. <laughs> They're either new games that I added recently or they were the bottom of the barrel from uh, previous vets. You never know who's going to rise up, what the matchups are going to be, right? All right, true crime. Three, five. All right. New pole. Animal well versus wild at heart. All about animals. <laughs> Like wild at heart. Again, two two games that are new games. Twenty twenty. The tw from the tw twenty twenty decade, which still isn't done. Zero to five. All right. Crash Bandicoot versus a Buck Rogers RPG. Crash Bandicoot. Buck Rogers. Yeah, we have 96 versus 90. PlayStation versus PC. Countdown to Doomsday. <laughs> I just had that music start running through my head. Which not one? the not the lyric version, but the mental version they Oh, Buck should. Rogers? Yeah. Not many people know the, dun, dun, the dun, 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 dun. <laughs> but something like uh how's that go? I don't know. You used to be able to just spout it off on Well command. it was well it was yeah. It's it was only in the movie version of Buck Rogers. Buck Rogers the pilot it's unusual, the pilot was in the movie theaters and you could go see it in the movie theaters. All right, Buck Rogers moves on. All right, two more. We've got Star Tropics versus Shatterhand. Shatnerhand. Star Tropics Shatterhand. The Shatnerhand is the the dual punch like that used to do as Captain Kirk. Both <laughs> NES games, 90 and 91. Oh, there was a Genesis port of it. Wow. I just always can't imagine playing RPGs on a console. <laughs> I don't know. I know the uh, JRPGs are... <laughs> Star Tropics will. Why? It, for me, it'd be whiten it more. Yeah. I'm not even looking at at the vote. I'm just sitting here chatting. Uh oh, it's tied. Who wants to break the tie?
All right, Star Tropics. Five to three. He's not losing his hair. I am. Yeah, well, that's why I said whiten it. All right, it's uh, Neil's favorite uh, game. Mass what? Effect Andromeda. All right, new poll. It's funny how Mass Effect is all the way at the bottom. Uh, Dark Messiah. Oh, Might Magic. It'll be Magi and Mass Effect Andromeda. And then we go. Now they do love to see me suffer. It's true. Someone asked for it. Uh, so Might and Magic was already added. So it was separate. Those are separate things. Uh, Might and Magic was earlier in the vote. I think it didn't win. Yeah, I kind of I kind of looked at the history of Might and Magic cuz I added Might and Magic to to the to the boat. Boy, they do really like to see me suffer. Mass Effect Andromeda. <laughs> I mean, it's not terrible. Yeah. It's, you uh, played it, didn't you? Did you play it all the way through? No, no you didn't. You I didn't got bored with it. it. Yeah, you got bored. But you'll probably since you don't tend to side quest it probably will be a little more tolerable to you because everybody yeah. wants to side quest you in that game. Go here and do this. Uh oh, oh, great. All right, so next time, A Hat in Time versus Unicorn Overlord, uh, Tales of Zanzara Zhao, Blasphemous, uh, Denji Dicey Dungeons versus Quake, and Freedom Planet versus Halo. Combat Evolved. Which I already own because that it came with the Xbox we bought, or that Neil uh, got me for my birthday. We tested it. We tested it today, and it, it worked great. Oh, it was loud though, really loud. That was the only downside. It sounded like a jet engine. It didn't sound that bad. It sounded. It was loud, but it was not like that loud. Yeah. What do you think it was? The uh I think it's the cooling fan. Yeah. Xbox is they've it, never had cooling problems. It's not it's not a it's not it doesn't sound like a hard drive motor problem. PS4, that is pretty loud, isn't it? There, I got it on the second. Oh, I should have done that and seen what what I get from it. Let me 
gonna happen. I just think there's gotta be a shard around here. The one problem with these prepaid gift cards is you end up with all of these cards with little pittance of money on it. You can't ever get it. Yeah, yeah, I don't know what to do. There's got to be something you can do for that. I've got one here with two cents on it. Like, you can't transfer it to another card or something? No, I mean, you might be able to go into some place with a cash register where they can take different forms of payment. Yeah. But the idea that you'll find a cashier who actually understands the POS system enough to do that is not sure. I always thought a POS system was funny. It's a piece of shit. I agree. <laughs> but I guess it's no worse than raw dogging. <laughs> you gotta explain that now. I thought I talked about it the other day. Oh, did you? Okay. I, may, I might have. Was it, I wasn't sure if that was a Facebook exclusive or if that was. Neil explains raw dogging. Well, I, I, have, I haven't seen a Ford's gumball machine in years. And a Ford's gumball machine was unique because it had it was not glass it was plastic and it had a flat front and you could put two pennies in it and get two chiclets it was the cheapest mach gumball machine you could go to Like a trip to the dollar store or something. Yeah. <laughs> I want to spend this three dollars. Ah, I missed it. Come on. <gasps> no! I was just being stupid. See, they don't have, they don't give you what you need. Oh, not this one again. I didn't realize, I thought we got way past this one.
I was being stupid. I was like, oh, I'm going to just jet over there. It'll be fine. I'm like one star away from an extra guy. I'm sure they did that on purpose. now. Oops. I wanted that. Alright. Oh yeah, that's right. I remember this now. Why won't you run? This room just looks evil. Oh, with the little bouncing up and down the, things? The bouncing zipper-faced people, the okay. weird floor. Looks like something out, out of, you know, like Beetlejuice and The Shining mixed together. <laughs> Although I guess those are just puzzle pieces. car wash I've ever seen. At least we got past it. Oh, and we got it. Is that the master control hamburger? Yay! What? 
the the thing in that last room it looked kind of like a hamburger with like lights changing on it like a computer uh, okay so I called it the master control hamburger It did some damage this time. I oh, bitch slapped me. <laughs> At least we got through that other one, right? in the face. Oh, what's he gonna do? <laughs> It looks like it'd be satisfying. When you form a little butt in the back and you just go. Whoosh, 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 whoosh. Oops. I hit the jump button, it didn't do anything, so of course I'm mad. See, I, I always jump way too early. It's funny when that thing vibrates against the table. The rumble yeah, pack. The rumble pack. It sounds exactly like sounded when my dad would close the door on the stereo cabinet and it would kind of vibrate against it. You know, the, the, here's the one thing that's annoying about this game is why can't I just hit him? Why can I only hit his hands? Anyway. I mean, they do the same crap in Mario games. <laughs> in Donkey Kong games. Basically any of these kinds of games. Yeah. 
Oh man, terrible. This, he's this, moved so slow. I keep I keep thinking he's gonna move fast. He doesn't. You were wrong. So we're like right there. And it also seems like stuff that's on Nintendo hardware is especially susceptible to this kind of shenanigans. Shenanigans. Why did I eat it? Just eat it. Well, I didn't push down, but apparently I did. Get yourself an egg and beat it. Sorry. I apologize to you all if my randomness this evening has bothered any of you. I don't know, I guess I'm just in a good mood and chat chatty. Chatty, chatty Kathy. That's me, chatty Kathy. How'd you know? <laughs> let's, uh, let's end here. And we'll come back tomorrow. I learned that from Donkey Kong Jr. too. Yes, we do. We all adore Neil. Um, I don't know if that's the last boss, but if it is, then we'll finish it, and then we'll start Star Fox. Uh, thank you, everyone, for being here. I stream every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday at 9.30 p.m. Eastern, and on Saturday at 3 p.m. Eastern. So I'll be back. What's today? We'll be back on Friday. If we're not dead. If we're not dead for moving our daughter into the dorms. Uh, we'll be okay. <laughs> um, if you can't be here live, go check out YouTube, youtube.com slash TV. Um, thank you to all these lovely, wonderful people over here. They're my subscribers. They get ad free viewing all those emotes and thank you so much for subscribing hearts. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Oceanic. I hope to see you on Friday. Um, yes, and thank you, Neil, for resubscribing. Uh, You're using welcome. that Prime sub, you know. Everyone gets a, a free Prime sub. My husband uses it on my stream, and I thank him. Well, I look at that as uh, sort of getting some of my money back. Right. <laughs> <laughs> it makes that Prime membership just a little bit cheaper. Um, if you want to hang out between streams... There's a Discord. And uh, thanks again for the raid, Shellshock. You there. had more than that, didn't you? You what? Didn't you have more than that? You had Julio. Oh, yeah. No, and... he just he just oh. did an emote. That's all. Yes, thank you to all the subs tonight. Shellshock, Julio, Top Red Bear, and I believe that was it. Yes. Thank you all for the raids. I will also send out my social media posts. Thank you for those raids as well after this let's find someone to raid where will the raid button send us today that's the big question hmm. well normally I would say to your mom but I don't think she's screaming <laughs> no she's asleep right now We read it. Can't remember. Yes, I believe we have. But we will we will raid Gamer Wolf who is playing looks like a modded version of uh, Super Metroid. It looks like they're doing some sort of Oh well, wait, how about I read this? It is a community async randomized multi-world game. There you go. That's who we'll be raiding. Did I already hit the raid button? I didn't. 
now I have hit the raid button. <laughs> Thanks again, everyone, for being here. I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful uh, rest of your week. And I hope to see you back here Friday night for more Kirby 64. Um, yeah, it's been fun. Remember, we love having you. We do. We love having you here and uh, having you in our lives, too. Th thank you for inviting us into your home. Yes. <laughs> Stay safe, everyone. Love you all. Bye. Bye, everybody.